and I'm back. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to play around a little bit with the new dollar store rings I got and um, my air series. I'm going to do a little bit more with air, but um, sporting a new green apron that I got from my L3. Thank you very much. I love it. It's green. And it's going to protect the rest of my clothes. So every top I own that I paint with does not become a paint top. <laughs> anyway, uh, I have a 11 by 14 canvas. And I'm going to try to do a flip and drag, but using the rings. Instead of having the cup and the section, I'm going to use the rings and start with that. Um, I already got my white base down. And um, I'm going to put the colors in this little cup, put the ring on the canvas and then pour the, the um, colors that way. And today I am using a little bit of black. Let me see, hopefully you guys can see that. I think I've given you enough room. So I'm gonna start with a little bit of black. I know I don't need a lot of paint for the flip and drag, so I'm using little cups today, so hopefully I can monitor the amount of paint. Just a little bit of black. And then I have the Liquitex, the heavy body. Um, it's the ultramarine blue. So the paints have the treadmill silicone lubricant in it and I did the cup with the OGX coconut milk in this red cup just to help release the paint. And I'm going to have the Deco Art Baby Blue. And I'm using some Craft Smart Aqua. And I apologize if you hear some landscaping noises, but there's some landscaping going on outside. <laughs> and then I'm going to actually go back, I think, a little bit with a little bit more black because then I'm going to put some worn penny uh, in there as metallic. Just a little bit. So the metallic is next to the black. Don't want too much black. And then the worn penny. This is probably already too much painting paint that I need. But I don't necessarily have to use it all. Okay. I am going to blow into it. Uh, I'm going to put my hand over it so you may not see it on camera, but I'll show you the cup afterwards just to get some of the air infused into it. Oh, it's supposed to be there. So my cup looks like. And I'm going to pull this back. And I'm going to put the ring. I guess I'll start with it in the center like normal. And I'm just going to pour it in here. And then I'll move it around. Actually, I think I blew too much. It looks like my colors have muddied a bit. But it's just a test. We'll see. So this, I'm just going to lift it up a little bit. And move it around. Okay. 
come back. There's a lot of paint there. I'm going to grab it and bring it back. So I have made gray. <laughs> uh, let's see. Um, still kind of pretty, but my colors have... Well, let's see how it goes. I'm actually... This got a little bit of a bare spot, so I'm going to take a little bit of the white and pull this over just a little bit. It's kind of just like a cup. Just move it around as you need it. There's canvas showing there. All right, so you know what? I'm going to just try something else. See if I can get the colors a little bit more. I'm just going to kind of go over. my line that's pretty and I'm gonna go over with this as well I'm just gonna try to blend it a bit to be as light as possible and not touch the canvas. Okay. I am going to move it back and forth, so I'll give it a quick torch, though. The colors are pretty. The gray is actually pretty. <laughs> it's not what I really wanted, but I am going to blow on it a little bit, so let's see. I'll just give it a quick little torch. I'm going to tilt it down a little bit. I like the line, so I'm going to try to tilt straight down a little bit and then the other way to try to keep the curviness of the design. And there's the baby blue coming up, which is nice, and I'm stretching the worn penny out a little bit. I'm going to go a little bit more because I see a little bit of the canvas that's dry there. And then I'm going to bring it out back. I think I might even go back this way again one more time. I know the design is negative space, but I would like a little bit. I'm hoping the ones here on closest to me, the right, will have a little bit more separation. So I have a little bit more curvy design. And I like that. I'm going to take it back to the middle. Now, you all know I don't have an airbrush. I spend all my money on the auctions. <laughs> but I've got my extended straw because I don't have the tube yet. I'll move these over. So 
Let me see what I can do. Overstretch that a bit. We'll try to get the paint better. In the middle. That's better. And I've got pretty good lungs, so I don't have a problem blowing. But and I like when Christina does it and get the wispy edges. It looks makes the painting look so much better, not so just flat. Oh, I need to do that. Don't touch your canvas. There's some blue and let's see if I can blow some of that out. Good. Turn this around a little bit. Next time I'm not going to use the black, I think. I'll just use it on the top layer. You know what? I need some white. Just something to touch up right here. So I don't think I need to do the air infusion. I think if I had just left the colors and did it like that, and then maybe did the ring around it. But the the gray looking stuff is actually, it looks like a silver gray. It's actually very pretty. Okay. Let's 
the way that looks. Add a little bit of white there. Give it one last torch. So if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, go ahead and click that subscribe button. And if you click the bell next to it, it'll let you know when I upload another video. If you could click like and share this video, I would love it. Leave a comment, let me know what you think. I am going to do another one of these without blowing into the cup first. And I already have the paints, but I'm not sure if I'll do it with these same colors or not. But yeah. Um, I like it. I like the baby blues. You can see the hints of the turquoise and the worn penny and um, the ultramarine blue shows up. I like the cells that it makes, but again, I didn't expect it to kind of give me the gray. I guess I should have thought about that when adding the black, but um, I like it. I think that's the level and hopefully not getting too bad of a glare. But yeah, I'm having fun with this air stuff and with my new gadgets, my rings and stuff. So watch for more of that. And I just thank you so much for watching and I will see you on my next video. Bye.